DD and Knuckles. And Knuckles. Oh, it's the curse of switching off. It's back. It has returned. So here we go on the red team. We have Nidoran, Sableye, and Grottle. And on the blue team, we have Spiritomb, Slowking, and Drapion. Grottle with a screen set with Giga Drain and Leech, uh, Leech Seed. It also has Light Screen as well and Reflect, so um, those are some pretty good moves for defense. Um, the Leech Seed be able to drain. And it's got it's got all right defenses, I suppose. But that's where the screens come in. I've been forgetting to do who's the best and who's the bum. Well, the, oh, the best bum is here so has okay. got it. Sloking <laughs> is the bum. <laughs> oh, yeah, then, well, Sableye is definitely the best, so that works. I usually don't, whenever we do this, I never look at their stats or anything. I kind of just look at the Pokemon and be like, hmm. Hey, hey, Spiritomb, Sableye did that typing first. You dumb dumb. There are two bums on blue team. One Spiritomb, one Slowking. Spiritomb's a poser. Uh, a ghost, a ghost in dark typing poster. Po poser. Shh, guys, you didn't hear that. Less than 30 seconds left to get your bet in on the switching off match. Akashic Record from Shin Megami Tensei Devil Survivor 2. That is like the most like edgelord title for a video game <laughs> ever. Shin Megami Tensei Devil Survivor 2. Devil Survivor 2. Yeah. Betting is closed, and we're back at the Sunset Coliseum. Womp womp for our free battle two player <laughs> battle. Oh no, we have to settle for this beautiful sunset instead of foggy courtyard battle. I cannot make heads or tails of what Sim is talking about, but here's a battle. Nidoran comes in with a poison jab. That's a hustle poison jab. I'm gonna deal some alright damage to that squeaker too. Not very effective against ghosts. Yeah, Spirit Tomb is going to go for a feint attack here. <laughs> that wind up certainly was a lot, but it did a decent amount of damage to back it up. Oh, a Shadow Sneak comes in. That's. Oh, it is enough. No, it's no, not! It's not. Yeah, it comes in with a poison jab again. Is there going to be a poison off this hustle poison jab? Nope, ghosts can't be poisoned. What am I talking about? Spiritomb goes for another shadow sneak here, looking to finish things off. And down it goes. Alright, so I believe switching is off, so up next is Sableye! Sableye second goes punch for comes second. out, but it looks like it didn't use a damaging move, and Willow miss. Willow Both missing. <laughs> On this turn, nothing happened.
Sucker Punch fails again as Will O Wisp misses again. Wow. All right, so Sableye goes for the Shadow Claw here, and it connects on the Spiritomb, finally does some damage. As Spiritomb goes for the Will-O-Wisp. <laughs> the will o Miss finally hits. They just wanted to admire the uh, sunset here. They didn't want to attack each other, so they just wanted to spend some time, you know. <laughs> it is a beautiful sunset, after all. Shadow Sneak connects here on Sableye. Oh, oh. Alright, damage on that Sableye, but it is a somewhat tanky Pokemon for its side. And Shadow Claw rips into Spiritomb. Oh, with the Ghost Dark Pokemon fighting each other, it seems to be messing with the equipment in the in the commentary helicopter. Sparks flying everywhere as we're trying to get a beat on this match. You know, ghost and machinery just do not go together very well. Slowking is going to protect itself here on this turn. As Sableye's uh, Shadow Claw is not going to do anything, and it's going to take some damage on this turn. Shadow Claw is going to be super effective on Slowking. Slow Whoa, nice. What a turn of events here we got. So Slowking able to take out Sableye with, with Brian. Not bad. So now it's down to uh, Red's last remaining Pokemon, which is Grottle. using Reflect. Oh, and Slowking foresaw an attack in the future. Probably trying oh. to set up another Reflect screen, but it's already up there. And Shadow Ball comes in for middling damage on that Grottle. A light hit. Red Team still has a chance here. Goes for another Reflect, and it's going to fail. Slowking continues attacking with Shadow Ball, slowly chipping away at Grotto here, looking to finish things off. And it Future Sight kicks by it. Future Sight! Didn't see that coming. Shadow Ball here Shadow connects Ball for the last time. Hits. And that's a wrap, folks. Blue Team is the winner with a 19% payout. Congratulations. And I believe with that, we are at an end to another hour of live commentary. I was Big Boy. As always, it was a pleasure. B-Boy Hour. B-Boy Hour is the best hour. Big Boyd is awesome commentating with you. Chat, uh, thank you everybody for having us here and commentate for you guys. Um, look out for more commentary blocks in the future um, with all our other commentators. And uh, we'll talk to you next time. See ya. See you later, everybody. Bye-bye.
illuminated by the beautiful neon light, an exciting battle is about to begin. The stage is set and the curtain is up. The blue corner makes the first attack. A rigid shot. Slam by Volta. It's down already. is sent out. The air in the Colosseum is tense and charged. Unbelievable! The Pokémon that just used the move went down! That just goes to show you, you never know what will happen at a Pokémon battle. is sent out. In terms of the number of remaining Pokémon, it's an even 50-50. Who will become the victor? Shadow Claw hits! It couldn't take it! It's down! Damon is sent out. The battle has reached its final stage. A harsh blow! That dealt some massive damage! The battle is getting intense! The battle has reached its final stage, and the tension is peaking. Fierce blow! The red corner barely holds on! The battle has reached its final stage! Rushing blow! It's down and out! Dragonair is sent out. The last Pokémon from each team will take the field. Both corners are in a tough spot. The end of the battle is getting closer by the minute. Shaman uses its move. The red corner still can't move. Dragonair had its health sapped by Leech Seed. The battle has reached its final stage and the tension is peaking. It fell asleep! Dragonair had its health sapped by Leech Seed. The red corner still can't move! Dragonair had its health sapped by Leech Seed. Dragonair fell asleep. The battle has reached its final stage and the tension is peaking. Yeah. 
Dragonair woke up. A fierce blow! Such amazing power! Dragonair desperately holds on. The move fails. Both corners moves fail. The red corner faces a fatal situation. Will the outcome be determined in the next turn? Slam them! It went down! Game, set, and match! The blue corner pulled off an impressive victory.